Hi guys, it's Lisa and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a what's in my bag video and show you guys what I put in my bag. Bags. Bags. Okay, the reason I have two is because... One for the left hand, one for the right hand. <laughs> one is for when I'm only out for a few hours and one is for if I'm out all day, okay? Because then you gotta add more things to your bag. That makes sense, right? Like if you go out for a night out or if you're just going to brunch and going home, then you don't need that many things. Starting with this bag, and the reason why I chose to use these two bags as display, to be honest, is because I already reviewed these two bags on my channel. So make sure you go check that out and watch the Dior Carol bag review and also the Chanel bag review. Starting with the absolute essentials. So even on a long day, I will include all the items that are in this bag. What's the first thing you have in your bag that you just can't live without? First thing that I cannot live without is my AirPods. I don't care if I'm going clubbing. I don't care if I'm just going out for dinner and I'm with people the entire time. I will always bring my AirPods out because I have just had so many experiences where sometimes I just need to hop on the phone and I need to be wearing earphones or something like that. My AirPods will always, always, always be with me. So this is the first item. What's the next thing you can't live without? The next thing I cannot live without? Oh my God, that's so hard. Duh. All of my lip products because I think multiple it's one night out so the small bag i will always have minimum three lip products one is a balm another one is a gloss and then another one is color and also my brow pencil as a lip liner i think that's just i don't know so i would say four lip products and that's if it's just a short night out so if it's longer then i'll have more the only makeup tiktok trend that i have actually continuously followed is the eyebrow pencil as lip liner because I just think that the brown complements your skin so well. But anyway, that's my other one. The next few items that I always have are sanitizer and hand cream. So the two that I really, really like are two from Aesop because who doesn't like Aesop products? The only times that I wouldn't carry these two around is if my bag is actually tiny. Like if I have one of those like tiny purses to go out for the evening or to go out clubbing or something like that or to the bar. I, I don't wanna keep saying clubbing because I don't actually club. Um, to go out to the bar, then the size of the sanitizer and the hand cream will reduce. But if it's like for the casual day, I'll always have these two. A lot of you guys know if you watch my channel that in the winter time, I get a little bit of eczema on the back of my hands. So I started um, regularly putting on lotion on my hands. And I would say that the only good thing that came out of COVID is me getting used to hand sanitizer because I used to hate hand sanitizer and absolutely will refuse to use it. I'd rather just wash my hands, but now I'm very comfortable with it and use hand sanitizer all the time. Okay, the next item that I would always bring is I always bring a spray because I always I don't know, I just like want to smell good all the time. And a lot of times if you go out for dinner, maybe the food that you are eating, like for example, Korean barbecue or whatever, you just end up smelling like smoke. So I always like to bring some sort of perfume. I will link this in my Amazon storefront. I bought these little travel perfume thingies from Amazon. The tip that I will have is if you do end up ordering this, make sure you pump out all the empty air first before filling it up. But you would fill it up from the bottom and then what you would do is you just basically take the lid off and pump your perfume and you can bring this with you. If it's a bigger day or like a week long trip, I actually might just bring the entire perfume bottle, but um, otherwise I will just bring this refill fillable bottle with me. Next item that I always bring is also gum because especially if you're going out um, for a really long time or if you're going out to eat, I just always love to have gum or a mint in my purse. I think this is pretty common for everybody. Another one that I think girls would find useful is having a hair tie because every single time I'm out and then I don't know, it gets hot or like you end up doing something, it's just so much better to put on a hair tie. This is the area that I put these three items, no, four. Whenever I go out, um, if it's a small purse, I will just bring my card. So I'll always bring my driver's license, health card, because you don't know what's gonna happen to you. If I'm traveling, I'll also bring my Nexus. 
instead of my passport. And then I bring my Amex if I'm traveling as well because there's always a lot of good points for traveling. And then the other one is my Neo Financial card. Um, I'm gonna touch upon this card later, but they just added so many more benefits to this card that I need it everywhere, even when I travel. Spoiler, there's only 0.5% foreign exchange fee if you travel with this card. So um, there's a lot of travel benefits, but also local benefits. You guys already know from me talking about it last year on YouTube, but your Neo Financial card pretty much also um, has amazing cashback on all local restaurants. This is not an ad, by the way. The next YouTube video might actually be an ad, but definitely not this one, um, but I still carry it around with me everywhere. Also, you can use that at Costco. The last section is I always bring a extra like tampon. I got this in Europe and it took me so long to get used to putting this in because there's no applicator, but honestly, it's so much better for the environment and it's so much smaller. That is the biggest thing. So now I'm actually a huge fan once you get used to how to use it. And then I always like to bring an alcohol wipe with me because there have been times where my phone has been absolutely gross outside so I like to wipe that and then I also like to carry an emergency feminine wipe so in case I don't know something happens and you can clean yourself up and that is part of the small bag so now on to if I am gone out all day six hours plus at this point I will carry my wallet and then I will have the credit cards in my wallet and the reason is because I have a lot of gift cards so you never know if you're gonna end up at the mall <laughs> and buy stuff. So that's why I like to have, and by the way, I also reviewed this card holder from Chanel. So make sure you go watch that YouTube video. It's just like, it's mostly for the gift cards. And then just also to hold my other cards just to make sure that it is okay. The next item that I have, like I said, I will carry a full size perfume if my bag will allow it, um, just so I'm not carrying the travel one. But the one that I've been using so far that I really like is also from Diptyque and it's in the scent Doson. Um, it's like a very androgynous scent. I think still a little bit more feminine, but I really like it. It's very light. And this is also why I like to bring it because it doesn't last as long as I would like it. I also bring my Ray-Ban Stories basically just sunglasses in general but lately I've been bringing the stories I'm sure you guys have seen a lot of my content on the Ray-Ban stories but you can also record with these sunglasses um, and also listen to music I find it really helpful if you're like traveling or I don't know if you're going out and you want to take your calls listen to music or navigate it's very functional so if you're gonna bring a pair of sunglasses you might as well bring a pair that also does a bunch of other stuff so next I also have oh my god two of my essentials Okay, this is also an essential, but a battery pack for my phone. If I'm gonna be gone all day, you better believe that I'm gonna bring this. And I'm only saying this now because my brother actually just got this for me. I didn't actually have this before. And this is actually really important because I don't carry any keys with me because everything is on my phone. As you can see, see? This is where I have like a bunch more lip products to be added so when I'm at Plus. Lip yes. So yeah. it's different. Okay, so this one, I actually carry a proper lip liner that's lighter than the brown, just so I can have like a day to night out um, look. And then this is like also like a redder, not a daytime lipstick. So depending on if I was going day or night, I'll carry both types of colors as options. And then this one is just my comfort one. I just feel better if I bring it outside. It is by Kaja. It's like another lip tint. So I like to wear it underneath my lip glosses. And I already have my lip glosses from my base essential products. I also like to carry a hair clip with me because to be honest, I like to use a hair clip more than I like to use a hair tie, but because hair clips are just taking up so much more room, that's why I prefer to just bring a hair clip. I like to also bring a little planner with me because if I'm out for a long time, a lot of the times I jot down ideas and I have a bunch of different um, use cases for it that I wanna write down, which also brings me to my next point. I also like to bring a pen and I like to bring a pen that has a cap, not one where you twist or where you click because it always destroys all your bags. I also talked about it in my 2023 goal setting video, so make sure you go check that out. Lastly, I bring some tissue with me. You want me to stole from me? Yes. I stole these, so I didn't buy them. Not from the store, from another person. And I stole them from the store. <laughs> I don't like stealing from a person better. 
but they know about it now so you know you know about it and then the last thing, this one you guys know from Instagram, but I carry this with me everywhere, especially in my tote bags when I'm out. And even if I'm canning at the beach or whatever, I love bringing this with me so much. This is the Caudalie Elixir Spray. This is what it looks like. They have the travel version. And whenever I'm stressed out or just bored, I just like to spray this. Um, it just has like such a lovely scent. It's like a very wellnessy scent. Um, and it just like energizes me. So I never touched upon it a little bit, but I couldn't help but notice you don't have any keys at all. <laughs> I don't have any keys because my car uses my phone as a key. I also have a smart lock, which is the August lock, and that is also on my phone. And then lastly, even for the fob to get into my building, I have this sticker fob on my phone. Fun fact, this is actually run by my friend Eric, his company, you guys might know it, it's called Minute Fob. Um, he has locations literally all over Vancouver, Toronto, and some parts of the US. So I will leave his website if you guys are also interested in using a sticker fob. They're so convenient because that way you're just not carrying keys, especially if you don't have to. What happens if your phone is stolen? Um, then I'm really fucked. I don't know. I don't know. You don't carry a backup car for your car? I do, actually. You're right. I should carry my car key in my wallet. It's okay. We're going to all this out. We'll, we'll unpack that after. Okay. So, we need to talk about this. Do you like living life on the edge? I do. Especially before I got this, for years, I was living life on the edge where all of my keys are on my phone and I don't even have a portable charger, so, so just like, if it dies and- Every night you go out, it's a gamble. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, okay. exactly. Oh, love that spirit. <laughs> All right, so my final question is, gun to your head, you're getting wrong. Steve's telling you can only keep three items. <laughs> what are you choosing? Okay, Quick. first one is easy, my AirPods. Um, um, a lip product, I'll, I'll choose this one. And then my hand cream. Not even your phone? No, my phone is in my pocket. You're getting robbed. Everything's gone. You can now <laughs> chose AirPods and cream and lip gloss. You can't even get a home. You can't get it to your car. <laughs> After all of that, and I don't... Right, you already is right there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I changed my answer. I'm going to have to ditch. Well, I guess, like, it would make sense to choose the most expensive items here. Okay, yeah, you're right. My wallet, maybe? Your IDs. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why I chose... I think it's because I only looked here. Okay. Change my mind. I will. I will carry my wallet. Okay. Yeah. These three. These three items. I mean, you could have gotten rid of the airplane and just kept the Chanel bag. Yeah, but you're really out here giving me free money. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that is pretty much it for the video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.